Yes. <laughs> right after the election and everybody found out who was going to be their family still. Because of the costumes. Which they normally wouldn't do. Right. Disney Channel shows always did Halloween episodes and they were always pretty good. They're like the good, the right amount of spooky. Nickelodeon used to do really good ones too. But yeah, and Halloween is just an amazing time of year. It really is. It's just an amazing time of year. Everything is just better. Hello everyone, my name is Isis Elliott and welcome to Literature. The show where I pretty much just sit here and get lit and then do whatever I want. Today, we're petting some animals. And then we're going to talk about the greatest holiday ever, Halloween. This rabbit is shedding severely. So is this cat. Oh, she's shedding so bad. Anyway, why is Halloween the greatest ever? Because it's amazing. It's one of the most social holidays. Like other holidays, it's almost like you're like guilted or something into feel into like being nice like for instance around christmas i feel like a lot of people feel like they have to feel nice or happy good to people around christmas or like thanksgiving especially last year's thanksgiving yes <laughs> right after the election and everybody found out who was going to be their family still number two i think it's people who like venture outside of their comfort zones every halloween especially once you get like with a groove when you get like a group of friends and you got you know that you guys do stuff Every Halloween, like you have like a click, you start to be a little more adventurous. Like you start to dress up a little bit more. Everyone starts to be a little bit more unique. People pursue more interesting costumes. Mm -hmm. Like it just ends up becoming, by the way, her name's Apple and she's a mini Rex and that's Xena. And she's a, some kind of cat. <laughs> <laughs> you can have a coat made of rabbit for a minute. I know, right? Oh my God that time for her to be shedding like this she's probably gonna start she's probably gonna start patting her cage soon with a bunch of fur it also leads people to do more adventurous stuff because like on halloween a lot of people will go and do stuff that they would normally not do mm -hmm. and i'm not talking about like, haunted houses or anything like so, like a lot of straight people will go to like gay events because of the costumes which they normally wouldn't do right a lot of people will go to like block parties or club parties when they normally wouldn't go out and do anything. Mm -hmm. And then I also like seeing the advertisements. The advertisements are always really good and when we were young, the TV was always really good. Oh yeah. Halloween TV oh, was the best. Number yeah, one- Especially you, Disney Channel. Yes, I was gonna say. <laughs> number one, you had the Disney Channel movies and shows. Disney Channel shows always did Halloween episodes and they were always pretty good. They're like the good, the right amount of spooky, scary, but not scary enough to make you like scared because mm -hmm. you feel like a child. Mm -hmm. And like, just good. And funny, but not like cheesy funny. Yeah, they just, they had so many movies. It was just so many movies. And they were so good that literally movies from like, early 90s, late 80s were still playing, uh -huh. like just continuously. And they still play like every year. Nickelodeon used to do really good ones too. But they were normally like movie episodes, like episodes of a show that were like two hours. Mm -hmm. Or something. Like I remember Keenan and Kel did a really good, really good one. Headless horseman type one. Okay. I love just the shows when they have Halloween, like normal Halloween episodes. Mm -hmm. They're just, they're great. And it seems like it, the writing just gets better around Halloween for whatever reason. Mm -hmm. She is shedding so much. If you guys can see all this hair, oh my god, there is so much hair. She is shedding so much. It's getting all, if, you, if you're wondering why I keep like going in my nose, it's because there's literally hair. Just going into my nose. It's so crazy. But yeah, and Halloween is just an amazing time of year. It really is. It's just an amazing time of year. Everything is just better. Stores get better. Ooh. And I think because it's the first season that's associated with fall and like how people love to change to fall. First holiday? First holiday. Jesus Christ. I'm so lit. I think because it's the first holiday is actually associated with fall. I think it like even holds, it holds more of the fall spirit than Thanksgiving does. Mm -hmm. Like because Thanksgiving comes later but like Halloween has already come. We've already seen like, and Halloween sometimes prettier because in a lot of places you still have green. So you have green with this dark mix of like, I remember North Carolina and, I, and how, around Halloween. It was like green with this dark mix of like red and amber mm. and like the yellow leaves. And there's like the dying ones that were like that rich brown. Mm. It was really pretty, but you still had green. So it was like a really cool mix. I don't know. Halloween's the fucking best. This video doesn't have to be forever, but... Well, it's only been like eight minutes, though. It's only been like <laughs> five minutes, I said. Um, have you ever been pranked on Halloween? Pranked? I was never pranked on Halloween. I never got that. I had a frozen egg thrown at me. 
Oh my god. It hurt terribly. I know everyone needs to watch their kids. I know there's going to be a lot of jokes about it because a lot of people like to make fun of it, but really do watch your kids because people do put crazy shit in candy. And ki people really will snatch their little fucking kids up on Halloween too. Mm -hmm. So watch your kids. Don't be like, oh, my kid is old enough and send them out on their own and shit. No. If they going out on their own and they're like 12 or something, on their own, I mean like just with other kids, it better be like 20 other kids mm -hmm. all walking in like a pack. I'm gonna need, don't be splitting up, going to other people's houses, don't do nothing, don't do none of that bullshit. And don't let them touch the candy until you look through it. Right, because I will be calling you and I will be FaceTiming you. And if I FaceTime you and you're not with that group of kids, I'm coming to get your ass. That's me as a parent. So please be careful. That's one of the bad things, because, you know, every good thing comes with a bad thing, because people suck and people gotta, people gotta fuck that shit up. Mm -hmm. I'm getting so frustrated with all this shit in my hair. I mean, my face. I'll just hair in my face. Jesus Christ. <laughs> so I'm gonna like stop this. We'll definitely have another Halloween discussion before oh, yeah. Halloween. Mm -hmm. So be prepared for Halloween part two. Say bye, Apple. So yeah, we're going to go. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck Trump. Mm -hmm. Fuck white supremacists. Mm -hmm. We'll be doing other videos soon. I love you guys. We do four. Oh, I do four of these a week. She's in them from time to time. Um, yeah, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Bye-bye.